Uh, hello, once again, everyone. Let me get this straightened out. Alright, I'm having another eBay auction of some pretty quality decks, which I would buy if I were you. But I'm trying to raise money for a new car. See, I have an envelope set aside. I need 1500 bucks. I have 265 right now. I get paid this Friday, as I do every Friday, at around 200 bucks. Um, I'm having actually a lot of auctions. Let's see what I got. Mine, I'm having exactly. Seven auctions. Damn. This is only leaving like two fingerboards in my inventory. Don't worry. My favorite one I'm keeping. My own wood. But I'll show you what I'm auctioning off. I'll start off with a Flatface G12 engraved deck I got from Flatface. The first, like, stock they had of engraved decks. I haven't used it much. I have FBS Extra Smooth. It is an engraved deck. Clean. You can see some use through the lacquer. Like maybe a few scratches. But it doesn't affect performance at all. And this also makes a great display deck. Um, clean. Nice and clean. Great fingerboard. G12 engraved. Um... By the way, before I start, all these auctions are starting off at $9.99. So if I were you, I'd really bid on these. Next, I'll start off with a... I mean, not start off. Next is a uh, 30 FB deck I got from Flatface. Um, it, there is a chip on the end right there. Right there. But it doesn't affect performance at all. Everything is nice and good on this deck amazingly dumb bottom ply I, uh, I think it's dyed because you can see like through the side of the plies the color uh, good dyeing skills in my opinion this is one of my favorite bottom ply decks there's no grip on the top I can get rid of all this like gook um, I don't seem to have it up here I'll probably get rid of it after the video so it'll be like nice and clean and smooth you can put any kind of grip on there. Pre-cut FBS Extra Smooth fits it with a little line cut. Uh, that worked for me perfectly. Now the holes are drilled perfectly. Kingpin holes. Nice side ply. Beautiful shape. Almost like a real skateboard. Nice dips. It's a really skinny deck. Let's see if I can like, block out the background. It's a really skinny deck which makes it light so it flips faster and uh, very easy to ride, you get tricks higher on this deck very good deck, the lacquer on it is amazing, it shines like no other next is a alright, next is a Frost G2 Mellow um, graphic bottom, Frost fingerboards this deck is drilled perfectly. This is actually one of my better performing fingerboards, but I'm sad to see it go. But I'm trying to raise money for a new car. Plies go from plain blue, white, blue to plain with the graphic bottom. That won't wear away. Uh, the lacquer on this shines very nicely. Very thin coat of lacquer though. But I think it, I mean, it performs amazingly. Pre-cut FBS Extra Smooth, perfect holes and kingpins, kingpin holes. Next we're getting into like the pretty, pretty decks, like pretty. A Scott B G2 engraved with plain to red to yellow to red to plain. The engraved bottom with wide trucks, uh, flat face G6 D wheels and rip tape that I cut myself which fits this deck perfectly um, there is some wear on the deck but honestly in my opinion it's almost like new like the only wear you're gonna see is like the black marks on the end of the deck from grinding that can come right off with some water like 
dab some water on your finger and rub it against it. Um, rip tape all the way around. You can tell it was cut, but it does fit the deck beautifully. Perfect holes, wide trucks, rip bushings, fly face wheels. Um, next is a Berlin Wood 2010 Elias a Smith Pro Model. Um, I'm sure you remember I tried to sell this deck last in the last set of my auctions. The guy never paid for it. He refused to pay. So I had to file this whole thing with eBay, and that that really hurt me because this deck sold for like 125, which is pretty decent. Uh, it's got rip that I cut onto it perfectly. The screws are under the grip. Wide trucks, flat face G6As. Plies go from plane to plane to blue to plane to plane with the Elias, Usmith, and Burnham Wood. The lacquer on this deck is beautiful. Let me see if I can get the fish eye on so you can get the whole deck. And there we go. Let's see if I can get rid of this. There you go. The deck is beautiful all on its own. Uh, sad to see it go, but I mean, new car. So, next is a Berlin Wood Old Mold Old School deck with rip tape that I cut myself, which is, I love this rip tape job. Uh, pretty new rip, too. I mean, it is slightly worn in, it still needs a little bit more wearing in to go. I cut the rip myself, and in my opinion, it's almost perfect for this deck. The plies go from plain to brown to purple to brown to orange dyed. The Berlin Wood sticker, wide trucks, uh, Jace wheels, uh, rip tape bushings. This deck performs really well. And finally, what I think should bring the most is a flat face G12 two-tone G6A wheels. Uh, Pre-cut, FBS, extra smooth, the screws are under the tape. Um, this deck, I am very sad to see it go, but I need the money. And well, so if you guys want to help me out, bid on these decks. Um, I certainly can use the cash for my new car.